Discovering the fun of RC flight is easy with the HobbyZone Delta Ray. Revolutionary safe technology makes this sleek delta wing design easier to master than many conventional trainers. In fact, most pilots can teach themselves to fly with it even if they've never touched a transmitter before. It comes ready to fly with a Spectrum DX4E transmitter with batteries, a LiPo flight pack, and a charger. It's been equipped with a safe receiver that gives the pilot four flight modes to choose from. They are beginner mode, intermediate mode, experienced mode, and panic mode. Pilots can choose between beginner, intermediate, and experienced modes using this three position switch on the transmitter. Panic mode, which is used to quickly recover from unusual attitudes, is activated by pressing and holding the spring-loaded button here. We'll cover panic mode in more detail later. First, let's go over the regular flight modes, starting with beginner. Beginner mode gives first-time pilots a narrow flight envelope that prevents aggressive bank or pitch angles. Even if a pilot holds a control stick at full deflection in any axis, the plane will never bank or pitch beyond the limit set for beginner mode. When the control stick is released or returned to center, the plane will immediately return to level flight on its own. This positive stability, combined with the model's small size and relaxing airspeeds, is what makes it possible for someone to teach themselves how to fly. It gives them more time to process how the plane responds to control inputs and learn. Another advantage of beginner mode is takeoff and landing assistance. When the throttle is pushed full forward for takeoff, the Firebird Delta Ray will climb away at a gentle angle without any pitch command from the pilot. The pilot can command a higher climb angle if they want, but only to the limit allowed by beginner mode. Beginner mode also helps keep the wings level during climb out, so that all a pilot really has to focus on is steering clear of obstacles. To land in beginner mode, a pilot simply lines up with the landing area and gradually reduces the throttle to achieve the right glide angle. Even with the throttle pulled all the way back, SAFE will keep the wings level and prevent dangerous nosedives. After they've mastered the basics, pilots can advance to intermediate mode. In this mode, greater bank and pitch angles are allowed and there is no self-leveling. The flight envelope for this mode is basically programmed to keep the aircraft from pitching or rolling inverted. Most pilots will never reach its limits if they stick to basic flight maneuvers. For those who've proven themselves in beginner and intermediate mode, there's experienced mode. In experienced mode, all limits on pitch and bank are removed and there is no self-leveling. Pilots can explore the full range of maneuvers the airplane can perform. And they'll do so with the smooth, precise response of full-time AS3X technology that's always at work no matter what flight mode is chosen. Without a doubt though, the coolest safe feature on the Firebird Delta Ray is panic mode. Panic mode can be activated at any time, in any flight mode, whenever a pilot feels overwhelmed. It doesn't matter how fast the plane is going or what attitude it's in at the time. When a pilot pushes the panic button on the DX4E, the Delta Ray will immediately return to straight and level flight. Even if a startled pilot has the sticks held to their extremes, when they push that button, panic mode overrides their commands and keeps the plane straight and level until the panic button is released. Finally, because the Firebird Delta Ray uses differential thrust from its motors to control yaw, the development team has given it some extra safety features. When the model is first powered up, SAFE will prevent motor operation until certain control conditions are met. This allows a pilot to pick up the plane and handle it during pre-flight checks without the motors reacting to movement around the yaw axis. Likewise, after landing, SAFE will disarm the motors if the throttle stick and throttle trim are pulled all the way back and the controls have been neutral for longer than five seconds. While we've covered how SAFE technology is applied to this particular model, we know you may have questions or want to know more. That's why we've created FlySafeRC.com. This is the official website for SAFE technology. In addition to frequently asked questions, you'll find complete details about SAFE technology, videos on other SAFE-equipped aircraft, and more.